Hello everyone and welcome back to The Breakdown. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to download and install Quick Leaf Decay in Minecraft 1.14.4. We're going to be going over every single step of getting Quick Leaf Decay in 1.14.4 and basically Quick Leaf Decay is just a simple little mod and all it does is allow you to quickly decay leaves in Minecraft. Basically you chop down a tree and the leaves are going to disappear a lot faster. It is kind of annoying to, you know, wait for all these leaves to finally go away and this allows it to happen very very quick and very very speedily in minecraft 1.14.4 first of all though we do have a message from our sponsor which is apex minecraft hosting go to the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash apex to get an incredible 24-hour ddos project in minecraft server for you and your friends we actually love apex so much that we host our own server play.breakdowncraft.com on them so if you want a great minecraft server for you and your friends look nowhere else than apex minecraft hosting you can check out apex again at the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash apex nevertheless let's go ahead and jump Jump right on into this, let's get Quick Leaf Decay installed. Now the first thing you're going to do is obviously download Quick Leaf Decay and you can find the download link at the second link in the description down below. When you go down there and click on that, it will take you here. This is actually our tutorial on installing Quick Leaf Decay. If I go too fast or anything for you, this right here will help you out and uh, allow you to figure things out without having to like roll back the video a thousand times if I go a little too fast. But nevertheless, once you're here, you just want to click on this yellow Quick Leaf Decay download button here. When you click on that, it will take you off to the Quick Leaf Decay download page. Where on the right hand side, you'll see Minecraft 1.0. 14 here. When you see that, you'll see Quick Leaf Decay under it. Go ahead and click that purple download button next to it there. The download will then go ahead and start. Now, you will need to keep this file or save the file depending on if you're on Chrome or Mozilla Firefox. On Google Chrome, like we are here, in the bottom left, it's went ahead and downloaded. And as long as it says Quick Leaf Decay, you get to keep the file. On Mozilla Firefox, same thing. It's in the center of your screen, though, and it's going to say, are you sure you want to download Quick Leaf Decay? And you do, so go ahead and click Save there. Now, we need to go ahead and download and install Forge. So, Forge, we need to download it. You can check it out in the description down below. Third link down below will take you to Forge here. You want to scroll down to this green download Forge button. However, I do want to mention if I go too fast, if you have any issues downloading Forge, this article will help you get through it as well. But let's go ahead and click the green download Forge button here. That will take us off to the Forge's official website where we want to make sure we download the 1.14.4 version of Forge. As we can see, it downloads for Minecraft 1.14.4. If it says this here, you're good to go. If it doesn't, no worries. Click on the plus over here on the left hand side on 1.14 and then click on 1.14.4 then when you see mc 1.14.4 here you're going to come under download recommended and click on the installer button here that will then go ahead and download forge in the bottom left as you can see forge 1.14.4 we want to go ahead and click keep here to keep the file and then we're, we're good to go now on mozilla firefox you will need to save the file on the server screen as long as it says forge in the file you're good to keep it now we can go ahead and minimize our browser here and on our desktop we have quick leaf decay and we have forge we're actually going to be starting off by installing forge here so go ahead and right click on forge click on open with and then you should have java tm platform se binary if you don't have that though no worries we've got a solution for you in the description down below you'll find java linked right here and you will need to download and install java for minecraft mods in order to get minecraft se binary and this goes through the entire process of doing that it has helped over half a million people actually over 800,000 people now install java for Minecraft. Now we aren't done just yet. If you still have issues after installing Java, you may need to run the jar fix, but you can also find linked in the description down below. Go down there and go through this tutorial. Very, very simple. Download it and run it. And basically it makes all the jar files on your computer work with your computer with work with Java once again. So you know Forge and all that will work with Java once again. Now we go ahead and minimize our browser. We can finally right-click on Forge, click on open with, and then click on Java TM platform SE binary here. Then we can go ahead and click OK and it will open up our mod and system installer for Forge, basically the Forge installer here. Now what we want to do is click on install client and click OK. Then Forge will go ahead and download and install just like you, you would expect. And you will only have issues here, right? You only have an issue here if you've not played Minecraft 1.14.4 with no mods installed. If that's the case, go play it open it up basically and then come back and this will work now we can go ahead and click ok because we've successfully installed profile for forge now we can go ahead and install quick leaf decay to do this click the little windows icon for me it's in the top left for you it might be in the bottom left but it's probably going to be in the top or bottom left of your screen that little windows icon there click on that and then type in run r u n you'll have this run app here go ahead and click on that run app and then in this text box here you want to type percent sign app data percent sign percent at data percent exactly like that and hit enter then we'll open up our roaming folder here in here you'll have a dot minecraft folder and in here you should have a mods folder but nick what if i don't have a mods folder well no worries no worries whatsoever create one just right click in this white space over here and then create a new folder and then title that folder mods mods all like that all lowercase 
If you don't do it exactly like this, it won't work. So make sure it's all lowercase and it says mods there. Then go ahead and open up your newly created mods folder and take Quick Leaf Decay and drag and drop it into that mods folder. Now, you've installed Quick Leaf Decay, but we aren't done just yet. We need to make sure we're opening up the correct version of Minecraft in order to run Quick Leaf Decay. To do this, open up the Minecraft launcher here, and then down here next to the play button, you'll have this little arrow. Click on that, and you should have a Forge profile. We have that, click on it, and click play. But if you don't, no worries. We have a solution for you and can help you out. So what you want to do is click on the Installations button up here on the top of the Minecraft launcher, and then click this Plus New button. You can name this whatever you want. I'm going to name it Play breakdowncraft.com because that is our Minecraft server. We have an incredible grief protected survival as well as incredible custom skyblock. You absolutely love it. Over 150 players online every single day of the week. So come play with us on play.breakdowncraft.com, the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. Now let's go ahead and click this drop down box under version here and we will see forge release 1.14.4 dash forge there. Click on that and then I'm going to change my resolution. That's just because you guys will be able to see better in game once I do that. But what's the most important here is that the version is released 1.14.4 Forge. Might not be the same version number, but it should be 114 and Forge. Then go ahead and click Create. Now, down here at the bottom, you'll have your version of Forge that you created, your profile here. In our case, play.breakdowncraft.com. Then go ahead and click Play on it. Now, at this point, it's going to launch Minecraft 1.14.4 with Quick Leaf Decay installed. However, it might freeze. It's going to take a while to open up in the first place. You can see we're sitting here and still opening, still opening, still opening, still opening. It's eventually going to open up, but then when it's opening, it might freeze. And if it does that, absolutely no worry. Don't freak out about it. Just close out of Minecraft. Hit that red X right there, and then it will close out of Minecraft, and then open it right back up with Forge installed, and it will work. I don't know what that is, but it's a little issue I've ran into in Minecraft 1.14.4 Forge, and I wanted to mention it here. However, if we go ahead and click on Mods here, we will see Quick Leaf Decay is in fact installed. We can check it as well in game, so I'm just going to go ahead and create a new world. Actually, I don't think this world has any mods on it, so we'll launch right on into this world. Why not? Once we've launched into this world here, I'll be able to give Quick Leaf Decay a test, and then we'll be good to go. So we've got some trees over here. Do we have any oak trees? I mean, these are those are massive trees. Okay, here we go. I see an oak tree hiding back here. Yes, yeah, so we can go ahead and chop this down. It works in creative and in normal, basically, Minecraft as well, like survival. And as you can see, those quickly decayed there. I don't think there's any denying that Quick Leaf Decay is working. I can go ahead and cut down one of these larger trees as well here. We go ahead and cut all of that down right like so boom it immediately goes away so there you have it that is how you can download and install quick leaf decay in minecraft 1.14.4 if you have any questions about quick leaf decay let us know in the comment section down below and be sure to come play with us on play.breakdowncraft.com the best minecraft server in the multiverse we have custom survival custom skyblock green protected survival over 25 quests on our medieval survival world and a slash shop based economy on our aquatic survival world you absolutely love it so come play with us Play.breakdowncraft.com is the IP. Over 150 players online every single day. It's just a random day right now, and we're at 122 players. Awesome. Come play with us. Play.breakdowncraft.com. You'll absolutely love it. Anyway, my name is Nick. This has been The Breakdown. Thank you so, so much for watching, and I am out. Peace.